Welcome back. Northeast Township and borough leaders want to know more about an option Granite Ridge is considering to house unaccompanied migrant children on their property. Our Lisa Adams is joining us here in the studio tonight after Lisa, you asked leaders in Northeast today for their reaction. Uh, did this catch them by surprise this proposal? Yeah, good evening. We had the story on Friday and it did catch them by surprise. And since the historic seminary property sits on the border of Northeast Township and Northeast Borough, both sides are now getting a lot of questions since that story broke and they need some answers. Space on a Northeast landmark, a former seminary and most recently Mercyhurst Northeast may become a new site to care for vulnerable children from outside the U.S. until they're reunited with their families. That option confirmed by management for Granite Ridge late last week. But which parts of the property? What's in the borough or what's in the township? And how soon? And what happens to people now renting townhouses at Granite Ridge? Township and borough officials have none of those answers. It's hard to respond to anything that we don't know at all what they're doing, so I really can't respond to that, but you know, we'll take that as it comes. As this kind of came out over the course of the last couple of days, I think more discussion is necessary, and that's been our intent in the first place, is to get a good grasp of what's going on, what's on the table, and how can we um, assist or respond. A resident now renting a townhouse doesn't believe she'll be asked to move now or when her lease is up. She sees the idea as similar to when 100 kids from a Jewish camp were here last summer. Greg Townsend, pastor of the First Presbyterian Church in Northeast, says if the option for migrant kids does happen, he believes Northeast churches will be welcoming. When a stranger enters your life, you welcome them. And in Matthew 25, he talks about that, about meeting the needs of people, the practical needs of people who come across your way. And that when you do so, you're greeting him, you're welcoming him, you're feeding and clothing him. And I know that's what our church would be all about. And I can't help but think that every church in our town would be the same way. So the township and the borough expect to be fielding plenty of questions, some from less welcoming residents at their regular monthly meetings, both coming up on Monday, April 3rd. The township plans to invite a representative from Granite Ridge to join them. They meet at 730. The borough meets at 6. Live in the studio, Lisa Adams, Erie News Now.